Welcome to Gradient Flow Snapshot number 23. How can a developer's laptop become an infinite cluster? The new AnyScale platform allows developers to use their preferred development tools, such as an IDE, notebook, or text editor, and seamlessly burst into a cloud platform when needed. AnyScale syncs code on your laptop to the cloud. Machine learning developers can use TPUs or GPUs and scale out to a cluster as needed. Developers need to efficiently manage multiple processes that handle data and communicate with each other. The open source project Ray is becoming the software platform for building distributed applications. Since AnyScale uses Ray, it supports stateful applications that are as fast as those built from scratch by experts in distributed programming. See Gradient Flow newsletter number 19 for more. A new podcast from Reveal looks at safety records and automation at Amazon warehouses. Based on data from injury records for 23 Amazon fulfillment centers and warehouse workers' statements, Reveal reports that Amazon warehouse workers are getting hurt on the job far more often than the industry average. Here's a quote from the podcast. We looked at the most common type of Amazon fulfillment center, where most of your packages come from. Some have robots and some don't. And we found that the ones with robots had a serious injury rate more than 50% higher than those without. Physical safety is an aspect of automation that needs more attention across many industries. See Gradient Flow newsletter number 19 for more. It's common knowledge that social media influence campaigns can shift or polarize public opinion on a hot topic. The new Social Media Analysis Toolkit, or SMAT, provides a free and open way to see what's trending on internet platforms, including Twitter, Reddit, 4chan, and 8chan. Users can see what topics are trending during a certain time period, who's driving the conversation, and what links are being shared the most. To learn more, visit gradientflow.com newsletter and subscribe. Thank you. Mm-hmm.